Hey guys, how are you all doing? I'm doing great. I'm in Maine. Uh, we're going to be here for another week. So that's why you did not get a video from me last week. If you follow me on Instagram at the Miss Mrs. Mom, you do know that I've been on vacation. Um, and last week I was in like rural Maine. There was no cell service. Um, and I had to go to like a different house in order to get Wi-Fi. So yeah, there was no video that were being uploaded last week. Anyway, I'm back. Um, I'm still in Maine. We just are in Portland now visiting with Matt's childhood best friend. Um, and there is Wi-Fi here. So I'm going to be uploading a video, um, two videos this week, like normal. And I thought today would be fun to do a what's in my bag video because I'm cleaning it out. I don't really know what's inside of it. Um, there's probably a lot of strange stuff, so we will see. Yes, I did bring my Louis Vuitton Speedy 30 to remote Maine. It just stayed in the cabin anyway. Um, anyway, there are tons and tons of reviews about the Speedy 30. Um, I don't really need to go into that. If you'd like my thoughts on the bag, I would be happy to do another video like that for you, but I don't think I need to go into like specifications of the bag because it's a very popular bag. I will say this though, it is my favorite bag of all time. I've had the Speedy 30 before and not in the bandolier, sti bandolier style, meaning that without the strap, um, it um, I had it for a few years and then when I became a mom, the top handle just wasn't, um, it just didn't work. So yeah, I ended up selling that um, Speedy 30 and buying the bandolier and it is awesome. Perfect size for me and my daily life and I just love this bag. I've always loved the Speedy. It's my favorite style handbag ever. So. Let's clean this baby out and you should see my setup right now. I know that a lot of people when they watch what's in my bag videos, they end up not seeing the bag because the person will like put it in their lap and then they can't see the bag. They're just pulling stuff out. So I have put a suitcase on top of this bed and the bag on top. So at least you can admire the bag while I'm doing this. So let's dive in. Um, so in the top pocket right here, the little zip pocket I've got. Hair tie, two hair ties. What is this called? I can't remember what this type of hair tie this is called, but I love these. It doesn't leave a dent in my hair, which is awesome. So I can like pull my hair back and then pull it back down and there will be no dents. So love those. Um, this is from Charlotte Tilbury. I forgot what it's called, but this is like the better than lips, I think. Thing. Um, I really do like this. So my lips are naturally like pale pink. Um, and if I'm like at the beach or, you know, like something like that and just want like a tint on my lips, this is perfect because it does, it adds, it just like literally adds a little bit of color, but it's not lipstick. So it's really, really nice. Um, so I always have this in my bag just in case. And I have gum wrappers. Um, I have my iWatch, which is dead. I need to charge that. My Nook, I'm reading this book right now called The The Edge of Never, I think is what it's called. It's a little young adult. Yeah, The Edge of Never. I'm on the first book. I think there's like three books in the series. I could be wrong, correct me if I'm wrong, but I'm enjoying it. It's just a very fluffy young adult book, but you know, I didn't want anything too involved. Of course, my beautiful A6 um, Apunto from Delio. This is the ostrich and chestnut. I have tons and tons of um, flips. Well, not tons of flips, but I have a ton, tons of videos with this featured inside of it. So you can check out more videos on my channel for this. Ooh, my sunglasses. So this is by a brand called Gentle Monster. My mom got this for me for Mother's Day. Best sunglasses I have ever had in my life. Um, so the story behind this, it's a Korean brand. Yeah, let me put them on for you. They are massive, but 
for my Filipino, well, Asian sisters out there, you will love these because I don't have a bridge in my nose. There's no, there's no bridge. And these are like extended. And sorry, my whole, like all of my in-laws are in this house right now. So you're going to probably hear kids running around, the dog barking, all that stuff. So yeah. Anyway, back to the dental monsters. These have extended nose pieces. So I don't have to constantly like push up on these babies. I love them so much. They're on, they're good to go. And typically when I buy sunglasses, I buy the ones with the nose pieces that like stick out. I don't know how, what you call them, but the like the adjustable ones. And whenever I pull up my hair and I have it up, like I'll be pulling my hair and my sunglasses at the same time. So I've always struggled with sunglasses. These rock. Gentle Monster, I will link the website down below. There's two sizes. I have the largest frame size um, in the tortoise. These are so good. They're always sold out though. So you have to like check the website constantly. But um, if you are a Cloyalist, meaning that you've watched the K-drama crash landing on you, you will know that these, the like main star wears these like so fabulous. I look so fabulous with these on. Don't even. I will say though that this though, the case is not, is weird. So once I find a different case that I like, like a cheaper one from Amazon, you best believe I'm getting a new one because this is weird. Like it closes like that and then I'm supposed to pinch that together. I don't know. I just want to I just want it to be easy, so. Um, okay, so on the clip, you know, that you usually use for your keys, I have this um, AirPod case. So here, this is my AirPod case, obviously, but I got this little holder thing from a do the dollar spot at Target. How freaking cute is this? And I'm always like searching in my bag for my AirPods, and then this just clips onto that little key and I never have to search for it. It's Awesome. So highly recommend checking out the Target dollar spot because they have all kinds of colors. All right, so I have my Lindoc pouch. This is the double zipper one um, cosmetic pouch. Let's see what we got in this baby. My inhaler, always need that. My compact, well, this is just a mirror. Better late than ugly. I have lady products. You don't need to see those. I've got my epinephrine um, EpiPen shot. I've got a nail file, some Visine eye drops, nail clipper, and nail glue. I'll explain why I have this in a second. If you follow me on Instagram, you already know why I have this. And in the front pocket, more glue. And dum dum wrappers and then dum dum lollipops. My number one bribery tool for Kai. <laughs> so that's what I have in this Lindock pouch. I'm sure everything else that's supposed to be in there is in this purse somewhere. More dum-dums. We've been traveling, so that's why I have so many. <laughs> okay, I have Lightning McQueen. Kai calls um, little toy cars go-go's. And I have one in my bag. Um, Chargers upon chargers. Wow, okay. So this is my... Air. This is my iWatch charger that's holding my paperclip. Yes. And this is my charger for my Nook. I don't know why they're in here, but they're in here. Let's see. This is supposed to be in my Lindoc pouch. This is Benadryl, but I also put in Tylenol in this case. So I only have to carry one case. I need, I need to buy one of those cute little pill boxes is what I need to do. Um, my sock. I don't know if that's clean or not. Uh, I'm going to wash it anyway. The other said sock. 
the, the match, at least they match. Um, mask, my aunt made these masks. This is mats. I washed the um, other ones. So I have a mask, because that's a new normal. One, two, three, four more tampons. As you can tell, my time of the month just passed. This is why I have nail glue, because I'm really into press on nails right now. Um, this is the mermaid one. I don't know if you can see that. Oh, there we go. And then this is another one. Um, I had nails on and ended up taking them off when we were in um, our last location. Plan on putting those on. Another hair tie. Oop. Fold that in here. Another hair tie. Little mini hairspray. Tresemme Extra Firm Control. Um, MT Altoids case. This is one of those magnetic, um, it's for like wire so they don't get um, all tied up. As you can see, I just threw it in the bag because all these other wires, <laughs> all these other wires are just free. This is my favorite scent right now um, by Joe Malone. It is wood sage and sea salt. I find it very light and like summery um, because of the sea salt. My other favorite go-to perfume is Mademoiselle by Chanel. Mm, smells so good. So yeah, I got this as a gift for Christmas. I wish there was like a size in between this and the big one. Um, but since this is almost used up, I don't know if you can see that. Um, maybe I'll just end up buying the big one. We'll see. My fountain pen holder. Um, I've done a review on this before in my pouches video. This is the Superior Labor pen pouch that is um, has the zipper on top. And I might as well just show you what pens I have with me. Um, I have my Schaefer Oversized Balance. This is a vintage. And then I brought my Pelican M800. My Pelican M600. Pelican M400. This is the tortoise and the white. The Pelican M400 and the tortoise and the brown. So I brought all four of my... I always say pelican, but it's pelican. Pretty. And then I always have a pen, gem pen with me. And then I have my Uniball Signo. A Sharpie. And the mild liner that I'm using currently for um, my sleep log and my no spend spot inside of my planner. And that's what I have in there. Um, I have a mint just in there. And then what I'm using for my wallet is also from Lindock. Um, it's their, her little wallet pouch thing. It's so cute. Um, and then I've just got cash cards and I keep my ID in the front so that's easy to grab. And that's what I have in there. And we have made it to the bottom. She is empty. That's, that's what we got guys I hope that was enjoyable for you um, I was cleaning out my purse anyway so I thought it would be fun to film a what's in my bag because it was not organized it was a hot mess so yeah that's all I have for you today if you guys want to say hi comment down below if you liked this video please like this video subscribe if you are new here i would love to have you join my youtube family follow me on instagram at the miss mrs mom um that's where i update like all day every day on what's going on in my life um yeah thanks so much for tuning in guys until next time see ya